all right everyone let us solve this retina part 3 uh, quiz for today and uh, i will solve uh, like during the questions how thinking what should be the thinking of you like i told yesterday before yesterday that thought process you see what is the difference of your thought process and what could be the thought process just see when you solve the when you see the explanation so hi everyone from pondicherry let us start the quiz i am ready yes three two one ready so I am getting the first question, the first question is which of the cells are basic cells lost in glaucoma? So I should know the definition of glaucoma is uh, optic neuropathy, progressive optic neuropathy. And optic nerve is damaged means optic nerve is formed by retinal nerve fiber axons and they are the axons of ganglionic cell of the retina. So that is the answer, the ganglionic cell is the answer. Why a ganglionic cell is involved? Because when the if retina is a screen like this, in the intraocular pressure is high. The closest cell to the retina, closest cell to the vitreous is ganglionic cell. So that is the first cell to be damaged in glaucoma. If that is damaged, nerve fiber layer is damaged, that will lead to progressive optic neuropathy. That is the answer. Let us see if it is correct or not. Correct. Because I have given the question. Second, the image question is there. The question is, uh, which of the following is not true for this? Array, what is this? Uh, this uh, left fundus picture showing some pigments. Now this is a classical. Pigments in the periphery is a most common retina dystrophy known as retinitis pigmentosa. There is a triad, arteriolar attenuation, waxy pallor of the optic disc and pigments bony spicules in the periphery. So now I know the answer retinitis pigmentosa but that is the question, no. The question is which is not true. Rods and cones are affected? Yes, it is a dystrophy of rods more than cones. That is what the early symptom is, night blindness. ERG is for the A wave for the rods and cones, B wave for the bipolar. A wave is an early wave decrease, yes. But in later stage, B wave can also be reduced. Yes, both are reduced. This cannot be the answer. Now, genetic analysis, the most common is sporadic. But it can be heritable also. It can be dominant, autosomal dominant, autosomal recessive, X and recessive. And genetic analysis can tell what the prognosis, yes, because also dominant has the best prognosis. x link recessive always has the poorest prognosis, so that is also correct. I am confident of A, B, C, answer has to be D. But arterial attribution is seen, yes, but not in the later stages, it is seen in the early stages. That is retinitis pigmentosa, answer over here. Audio. Audio, audio, audio. A hypermetropic patient. Hypermetropic patient. Six by six visual acuity. Six by six visual he acuity. Came for refractive error testing. Refractive error testing. He was having plus two adapter. Hypermetropia, so convex glasses. Plus two adapters in both eyes. No symptoms. He just came for refractive error testing. No symptoms. On eye examination, the antechamber was shallow. Antechamber shallow. The intraocular pressure was. Intraocular pressure was one seven seventy normal. Both eyes. Both eyes. Gonioscopy was done. Gonioscopy angle for angle of antechamber. The angles were occludable. Angle occludable means to see more than 180 degree closed angle. measure. Baki, it's the definition of angle closure. It is an angle closure disease. The diagnosis is primary angle closure suspect because the pressure is not high and no optic disc changes. I, you just listen, na? I have given the question. I know optic disc was normal, visual field was normal. Answer is primary angle closure suspect. You not observe. You have to do laser adotomy, but one eye, both eyes. Of course, both eyes. Both eyes are having hypermetropic. Both eyes are symmetrical. Na? In small eyes, in angle closure patient, the first thing is laser adotomy in the superior peripheral eyes to prevent acute angle closure. That is the answer of this question. See, I am correct. Now, false here is this. Another image question is there, but this is a black and white image. Now, black and white image uh, should be what? Angiography, not autofluorescence, because retina vessels have some dye. Now this is angiography, left angiography is there, fine. Something is black, black means hypofluorescence, yes. But see this black is in front of the vessel or behind? I can see the vessels, so it has to be behind. What is behind? Subretinal hemorrhage. This is subretinal hemorrhage, so let us see options. Left angiography is shown, true. Green arrow is hypo, true. Pre-retinal pre -retinal hemorrhage is in front of the retina. In front of the retina, I can't see anything behind now, so it cannot be pre retinal, it's a subretinal hemorrhage. And this can be due to choroidal vessels, like in ARMD patients. 
So answer falls as C. Wow, very good answer. Now what is not true for this condition? Condition is what? This is optical coherence tomography. Very good. This is RP layer and neurosensory retina is detached from the RP. This is retina detachment. But is it total retina detachment or central? OCT is only for central retina boss. So only macula, central retina detachment. This is the sub retina space. So this is a classical condition of central serous retinopathy. Serous fluid is coming from the retina. Exudative detachment, central serous retinopathy in a young male coming with distortion of vision, taking steroids. So patient have metamorphosia. Taking steroid, drug history is important. Taking systemic steroid. Fluid is in the subretinal space. Within three months, nothing to be done. Resolved on its own. anti vegf is not the answer. anti vegf is not given in this. Treatment is wait and watch. If it does not resolve by three months, then you close the outer barrier by photodynamic laser. But anti vegf is not given. And this is the subretinal space. Then what is the angiographic appearance of this? That's not in the question. Nah. But I can tell you it is ink blot appearance. Because outer barrier, if you put a dye, the dye will come into subretinal space and dye will rise like an ink blot smokestack. That is seen on angiography. <clears throat> Here the answer is anti vegf is not given. Now, which is true for primary open angle glaucoma? Pathology is seen on gonioscopy. On gonioscopy, I can tell it's open or closed. If you are if you are able to see more than 180 degree of trabecular meshwork, that is open angle. But pathology is in trabecular meshwork, yes. There is a blockage of the trabecular meshwork. I can see trabecular meshwork, yes. But I can't see the pathology, I remember. Pathology is microscopic level. It does not seen on gonioscopy. Gonioscopy will only tell it's open or closed. So that is true statement. This is a true, which is true for pathology is seen on, that is false. This is a false statement. Pathology is not seen on gonioscopy. Now symptoms are less than angle closure. It is known as silent killer of sight. There is generally no symptoms in open angle. That is a true statement. That is the answer. But why this is false? Gonioscopy and IOP both are done. Why is gonioscopy uh, done before is false? Because IOP measurement and gonioscopy both can be contact procedure. If you do gonioscopy first, after I, uh, after after that you put uh, the intraocular pressure by Goldman applanation, constant if you repeated touch the cornea, resultant pressure will be false low. So that's why IOP is measured first and then gonioscopy. And hyperopropia is a respect for angle closure. So silent killer of sight, open angle glaucoma is answer. What is this? Ah, are audio, audio. A 22-year-old male. 22-year-old male. 22-year-old male. बहुत आते हैं यार. क्या ये 22-year-old male, मतलब young male क्या करते हो तुम लोग? पढ़ाई कर लो. कहाँ आ रहे हो? See a movie. Mo movie देखने चले गए. Lapata ladies. Lapata ladies. He was enjoying the movie. वाह वाह. But suddenly he had an episode of extreme pain in the right eye. Movie में darkness. Pain. With, he started having nausea, vomiting. Nausea, headaches. vomiting, pain in the eyes. He immediately eyes. went <coughs> to see the doctor. Picture छोड़ दी. लापता लेडी छोड़ के चले गया डॉक्टर के पास That can be seen in acute angle closure and phacomorphic, but why phacomorphic? Nothing is written in 22 year old. There can be intermittent uh, cataract, so that is ruled out. Then and the intraocular pressure was very high. It intraocular pressure high, so it means that infectious keratitis. Why? Ah, it's me. So, if cornea is in a sense not infectious keratitis all the time, then it is okay. So what is the condition? The condition is acute angle closure in darkness, small eyes, acute angle closure. The, there is a pupil block mechanism. Iris is pushed. 360 degree closure. Iris Bombay. Iris intraocular pressure very high. That's why there is uh, mid dilated pupil because of high intraocular pressure. Sphincter atrophy is there. Cornea is haziness because of increase intraocular pressure. That is acute angle closure. You do first uh, drug is um, intravenous mannitol. Treatment of choice is laser aldrotomy. Which is the false for device? A device? Where is the device? Oh, are you device? So much better. ये तो यूज इन ग्लोकोमा ना क्या डिवाइस है दिख रही है मुझे आई नो मैंने मैंने दिया मुझे पता है दिस डिवाइस इज अरे 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 
गोल्डमैन एप्लीनेशन प्रिज्म गोल्डमैन एप्लीनेशन टोनोमीटर फॉर गोल्ड स्टैंडर्ड गोल्डमैन ने बोला उसके नाम में गोल्ड आता है इट्स अ गोल्ड स्टैंडर्ड टोनोमीटर ये क्या बात है गोल्ड स्टैंडर्ड टोनोमीटर मोस्ट रिलायबल टोनोमीटर इज गोल्डमैन एप्लीनेशन टोनोमीटर बेस्ड ऑन इम्बर्ट फिक लॉ बेस्ड ऑन एप्लीनेशन प्रिंसिपल सो लेट सी बेस्ड ऑन इम्बर्ट फिक लॉ इट्स अ कॉन्टैक्ट येस इट यूज स्लिट लैम कॉन्टैक्ट प्रोसीजर आई स्टैंड विद फ्लोर डाई येस तो ये तो बिल्कुल सही है इवन इफ यू डोट नो दिस thin cornea gives false low values thick cornea gives false high values even if we don't know this i know abc are true so this is false statement cause of tunnel vision can be all accept two drugs can cause wake up atrial and quinine that is true advanced glaucoma ring scotoma advanced glaucoma that is double arcuate can cause tunnel vision but this is not cured gyrate dystrophy maafi de do gyrate gyrate dystrophy that is also having even pigmentos i have but tobacco alcohol intoxication <clears throat> that cause optic neuritis that cause central centrosecal scotoma because of papillomacrobundle involvement that is not a cause of ring scotoma right 10th bhi to hai where is 10th nine no no one one more there na are 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 have i given nine there has to be 10th was sahi keh rahe the tum log hang hota hai main tumhari baaton ko vishwas nahi karta but ab main kar diya hang or it is hanging 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 i don't know what should be the 10th 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 they are how to get it what was the 10th let me see There is only nine, I think, no. So I'll give you the tenth one. Okay, I'll give you the tenth one. Best of luck. <clears throat>